right, so we got the pre-release for the new set, Temporal Forces. Uh, played in the pre-release set, the first place got a full box, but luckily they were nice enough to actually split a box with me. So let's go ahead and see what good stuff we can get from this new set. I'm very excited to get some of these new cards. I wouldn't mind getting a couple of the rare cards. We got Maridon, Maridon's good. We'll see how both of our luck fares. We got Scovillian EX, all right, we got a nice hit. All right, so when it comes to my pre-release tournament, oh, when it comes to the pre-release tournament, I didn't really get much of anything from the packs that came in this set. Realistically, the only EX card that I actually got was the Walking Wake, but I couldn't even use it because I actually got it when I had the Future deck. Okay, Cryodon, that's a good card to put into the next deck. I am looking to make the single prize Roaring Moon deck that is currently keeping strong in Japan. So hopefully we can get some Roaring Moons out here not be like paradox rift great tusk i'm gonna keep that separate because i might add that we got an arbok and an iron thorns of future all right but yeah uh in today's pre-release i had the metang promo uh trial deck and it came with the Coriad, no, and it came with the Mariadon, which is actually super good. You got a Whimsicott. So I was able to sort of establish using Metang's uh, ability to charge four uh, steel energies onto it and then prepare to use a Metagross. And then my Coriadon would prepare all my future cards so they can get all set up. Rampa. The nice part about knowing if I get hits or not is if I don't get hits, then I at least know that the person that took first, you know, got to take a lot of the good cards in this new set. I am playing another pre release tomorrow, so hopefully we can take it all the way and take the win. We got a right on rare. So yeah, we at least do have the Scovillian EX hit, so we do get something from this. And it's not too bad. I really just enjoy opening these packs. I don't think I'm going to be looking to try and collect all the cards from this set. Mostly just try and get some of the trainer cards. We get a Raging Bolt EX. That's pretty nice. But yeah, I think for this set, we are just going to try and look to get a lot of the playable cards. Mostly those Buddy Buddy Poffins. Um, a lot of the Baby Roaring Moons. Try and build that deck out. Explorer's Guidance. I am going to need more of those. Iron Treads. Ghastly. We got a Reverse Litten. And a Mel Metal. All right, our pack stacks are dwindling down. Let's see if we can get some good stuff in these last couple of packs. We got a Hoot Hoot. We got the Beldum. I use mostly in my games. Big Boy Metagross carrying most of my games. And if you look at the bottom, I see an A spec card. Okay. I have not seen an A spec yet. Let's go ahead and see which one we get. And we get the Awakening Drum. Is it? And a Cutie Fly 4. Okay. So this is actually really nice. So I actually needed this Awakening Drum because I did want to put it in my. Uh, I did want to put it in my Ancient Box deck. So it's a little sad that they didn't get it, but we will be taking this in and made, and preparing this for my Ancient Box deck. Now we just need a lot of the Roaring Moons. Cutie Fly will go there. Got the Awakening Drum dead center. So that's really cool. We did get the A spec card. I'm hoping that the other people that got packs, hopefully they get uh, maybe the special art rare. Maybe they'll get two A specs in that box. Hopefully, I'm really hoping that they do get some good stuff. Buddy Buddy Poffin, keep that separate from my bulk. A Bronzong, Pikachu, and a Macargo. Honestly, I can't really complain about the packs that I am getting. You know, it's really nice that they were a they agreed and wanted to split the pack. So we got a Mist Energy, gonna add that into Charizard, Sandy Shocks, Valiant, we got a Shiftry, and another Drampa. All right, we are closing it in to, towards the end. We got, I think this is gonna be sick. With this pack, it's gonna be six, pa six packs left. So let's see if we can maybe pull some of those rares. I think right now I'm looking to get a lot of the rare cards. Explorer's Guidance, nice, love to see that. LGM, we got a Crocna and a Relicanth. Honestly, I've actually gotten a lot of Relicanths today. Um, 
definitely going to be separating them from my bulk, but I don't know if there's actually a deck that I would be using that one in specifically. So hopefully we can get maybe some Roaring Moons. I did get enough Coridons, I believe. Get another Whimsicott. So yeah, I did get enough Coridons in order to build that deck. I think I may need one more Explorer's Guidance. So hopefully we can maybe get one more just so we can try and get those supporter cards straightened out. So code breaking, that's a good card. Keep that away from your bulk. We got a Saw's Buck, Sableye, we got a Mudsdale, and we got a Full Art Morty's Conviction. This is actually a really sick card. So this was a card that almost helped me into victory. We, we just kept drawing into cards, but unfortunately I wasn't able to draw into the right cards. I was pretty stuck for a while. My Tyranitar almost finished the game off for me. I needed to find two future and or two future cards in the, the last bit of my deck, but unfortunately I was one short. We get a Feraligator. Now I did do a pre-release event earlier than today. Um, that one went pretty decent. Went two and one. Um, didn't really get much of the pro packs, um, so. Mostly got a bunch of rares, but not the rares that we were actually looking for. So we got Unpheasant, Sent to Scorch, for Alligator, Go Lurk. Is this something? It is. We get the Iron Crown EX. All right, honestly, for half of a box, I think we actually went away with almost all of the hits. Because I actually do see something in this pack as well. We got a Great Tusk, Morty's Conviction, Pine Co. We got a Carcoal. And this will be the final one we get. Yeet. A Wug Trio EX. So a nice EX to round it out. So yeah, we got actually we got a ton of hits. Plus we got the A spec, one of the A specs that I am looking for. So let me know what you guys think of the next set that is coming out and how excited you guys are for looking into these cards.